Sis, I swear, if you make the bathroom smell that bad again. Okay, sorry, I won't. Everyone can't see me or everyone can't hear me. I feel like I could use being invisible for a day. I am so glad Bailey's not here today. I genuinely hate her. Me too, she's so annoying. Fake ass bitch. Why is there a dick on your face? What, what do you mean? Class, settle down and get that off of your face. Ass hat. Hey, who said that? Mary. Huh, what? The answer is 76. Where is that voice coming from? I'm a genie and I'm gonna get you 100% on this test. Really? Thank you so much. Can people still feel if I hit them? Ow, what the fuck? Quiet, we're testing. Marissa, why did you answer in the shape of a Christmas tree? Because the magic genie told me to do it this way. <laughs> wow, okay, how about we take you to get some help? Hey, sis. Oh my god, what is that smell? That McDonald's bag has been in here since like 2012. I think that just burned all the hair off the inside of my nose. Yes, I was not done being invisible. Bro, I just matched with the finest girl on Tinder. Does your girlfriend Bailey know that? No, of course not. Dude, why would you pour that on me? It looks like I pissed my pants. <laughs> it wasn't me. Where did that laugh come from? I can't believe the teacher thought I was crazy yesterday. The genie was real. <laughs> Ow, bitch. Why would you push me? I didn't push you. You little bitch. All right, everyone. Today, we will be having a pop quiz. Everyone, please take out a pencil and... Okay, who did that? It's not funny. No one's by the light switch. We have a car. Ah! 30 people can't oh die. Oh my gosh, no. I'm too young to die. Hey sis, what's up? Where's my Stanley Cup? What? You don't even own one. I need one. I'm not buying you that. It's like $50. All my friends have them, and if I don't have one, I'm not gonna be cool. If your friends judge you for a cup, they don't like you. I hate this household. I'm leaving forever, and I'm never coming back. Okay, but if you leave, there's no Wi-Fi on the street. Then I'm not going. What are you doing? Leave me alone. I'm showing them my 14-step skincare routine. Nobody cares. How did you even get that? Can you go away? Now you're ruining my light. Uh, excuse me. Ooh, are your leggings Lululemon? Um, no, I got them with my Kohl's cash. Ew, I only wear Lululemon. Okay, nobody asked. Can we go to Air One? I want to try the Hailey Bieber skin smoothie. There's no way we can go to Air One. Why not? Because we're in Massachusetts. Fine, I'll just go by myself. Really? How are you gonna get there? I'm gonna walk. Yeah? Good luck with that. And I'm taking the Sol de Janeiro with me. Come on, we have to go to school. But first, coffee. Ew, no way you just said that. I cannot function until I've had my coffee of the morning. That's so cringe. Mom wants a selfie of us together. Smile. Oh my god, what was that? I'm doing the duck face. Don't ever do it again. I thought it was trendy. Maybe in 2013. That was embarrassing. Okay, I won't. She wants me to take a video of you saying hi, too. Oh, okay, yeah, I'm ready. Okay, it's recording. Hi, Mom. Okay, stop. Why did you pause like that? What do you mean? Don't pause. Just say it when I record. It's recording. Hi, Mom. Oh, dude, you did it again. Why are you doing that? I don't know what you're talking about. Huh? Are you wearing skinny jeans? Yes, I love skinny jeans, and I love tucking my sweater into them. I can't be seen with you while you're dressed like that. That lip color is way too light for you. Stop being a Karen. That's not even how you use that word. Oh. A while ago, I made a video basically raving about these Burt's Bees makeup wipes. Burt's Bees saw that video and they were like, let us send you a couple of things, Shawty Bay. It looks to be about everything they have ever made. Right on top, there's a shirt. It would be criminal of me not to put this on right now. <laughs> I love it. Fuck a Halloween costume. I'm gonna go as a Burt's Bees chapstick. A shea butter moisturizing balm. I have to inhale it. We got three different sheet masks. They sent me four packs of wipes. You might be saying, bitch, that's only three. I started using this one and another one that's in my bathroom. Shawty got a little fucked up in transport, but that's okay. They know me so well, they gave me an emo one. These intrigue me because they're little gloss sticks. This is gorgeous. I love it. Last but not least, oh, last but not least, they gave me basically every single flavor of the lip balm. I'm gonna show you them all on a speed run. Watermelon, sweet peach, coconut and pear, dragon fruit lemon, vanilla bean, strawberry, ultra conditioning, tropical pineapple, and last but not least, pomegranate. Thank you so much to Burt's Bees for sending me all of this. I am so grateful. My lips and skin are gonna love me now. A lot of you have been asking for my everyday makeup tutorial, so I'm gonna give it to you and I will try to be quick. For primer, I use the B Goldie Drops by Drunk Elephant. Blend with your hand. I lightly fill my brows with the NYX Cosmetics Brow Pencil. NYX Brow Glue to hold them in place. I use one and a half pumps of foundation all over my face. This is Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk. Blending with this huge Tarte foundation brush. I'm putting the NARS Creamy Concealer over my blemishes. This is where I put my concealer and I use the Makeup Forever HD Skin. Blending it out with this Hourglass Concealer Brush. Makeup by Mario Contour Stick. This is how I 
put it, blending it out using an angled tart brush going upwards on my face and then bringing it all the way down to my jawline. I blend out my nose contour with my finger, bringing it up to the start of my eyebrow. For blush, the Charlotte Tilbury Glowgasm wand like this, blending it up onto my temple and on my eye. Setting my face with the Givenchy Prism Libre Powder, bronzing a little bit with the Charlotte Tilbury Bronzer, Patrick Ta Blush and She's Giving. I hate to do this, but go to part two. This is part two of my everyday makeup routine. For fake freckles, I use this freck tint and then I blend it out with my finger. Put them on the bridge of my nose and then very lightly onto my cheeks. For highlight, I use this Film Star Bronze and Glow Palette from Charlotte Tilbury. Do a little here and a little on the bridge of my nose. And I'm gonna put it on my inner corners with my finger and also under the brow. I'm lining my lips with this MAC lip liner in the shade Whirl. Over top, I'm using the Burt's Bees Gloss and Glow Sticks. Lastly, I've put some eyeliner just in the corner of my bottom waterline. And that is how you end up looking exactly like me. I feel like I did so much, but I kind of look the same. I've been seeing people get the most insane gifts for Christmas, so I thought I would do a more realistic Christmas haul. Starting with this bag, my mom always gets me a bunch of candy. Some Sour Patch Kids cold. You guys forgot about Rolos, but they're so good. And Tootsie Rolls because I love the vanilla one. I don't know what about these screamed me, but my mom got me some Care Bear slippers. Brace yourself for this one, it's really exciting. Dish towels. For Valentine's Day, just to remind me of how single and fucking lonely I am. Also got these pajama pants that I am currently wearing. Mom got me this cute little sparkly necklace with her birthstone on it. She also got me this cool little wavy silver ring. Sick! She got me some little hoops because I got really drunk one night and lost both of my hoops. Some this one killed me. It's mac and cheese ornament. My grandma got me a jar of honey. Why the fuck did someone just charge $96 to my DoorDash? I got a champagne toast candle. They put crack in here. I also got a pistachio biscotti. Damn. My sister got me these really cute satin Skims basketball shorts. She also got me this Skims bustier. And that was it. That was everything I got for Christmas. I hope you all had the best, loveliest Christmas of your entire life. And happy holidays if you do not celebrate Christmas. I love you. I've been seeing people get the most insane gifts for Christmas. So I thought I would do a more realistic Christmas haul. Starting with this bag, my mom always gets me a bunch of candy. Some Sour Patch Kids cold. You guys forgot about Rolos, but they're so good. And Tootsie Rolls because I love the vanilla one. I don't know what about these screamed me, but my mom got me some Care Bear slippers. Brace yourself for this one, it's really exciting. Dish towels. For Valentine's Day, just to remind me of how single and fucking lonely I am. Also got these pajama pants that I am currently wearing. Mom got me this cute little sparkly necklace with her birthstone on it. She also got me this cool little wavy silver ring. Sick! She got me some little hoops because I got really drunk one night and lost both of my hoops. Some this one killed me, it's mac and cheese ornament. My grandma got me a jar of honey. Why the fuck did someone just charge $96 to my DoorDash? I got a champagne toast candle. They put crack in here. I also got a pistachio biscotti. Damn. My sister got me these really cute satin Skims basketball shorts. She also got me this Skims bustier. And that was it. That was everything I got for Christmas. I hope you all had the best, loveliest Christmas of your entire life. And happy holidays if you do not celebrate Christmas. I love you. Get ready with me to go to the gym. For all the negative people come in my comments saying, why are you wearing makeup to the gym? Because I'm hot. I'm mostly doing this because I saw a really hot man at my gym and I keep showing up looking like the fucking monster under the bed. So I feel like I just need to be like ever so slightly cuter just in case the opportunity arises to speak to him. Also here come all the comments saying, I thought you were a lesbian. I am not a lesbian, I am pansexual. Recently I got back into my weightlifting era. It's just such a fun way to get all of your aggression out. I wanna look happy because I'm not bad. <laughs> this brush is so disgusting, but whatever. Oh, I'm gonna sweat all this off anyway, so I guess it doesn't really matter where I set. <laughs> Cute! Like Betty Cooper whenever I put my hair into a ponytail. I just got this little perfume from Who Is Elijah. It's called Nomad and it smells so good. Shout out to the time I used to do my freckles with a brow pencil and it literally just looked like I had fucking skid marks on my face always. Lastly, I have a little cherry colored lip balm from Burt's Bees. Am I one of the dark cherry girlies? Play, I'm gonna go be so sexy at the gym, bye! I know you told me not to eat your leftovers, but I ate them anyway. You suck! I was gonna eat that for lunch! Guess the artist for one, two, three, four, five. A lot of money. If you can't even count, then you're doomed. You should not play. Not true. I know I at least have a few brain cells. Blonde made a football man famous in Midnight. Hey, football's the one where you kick it, right? We're gonna be bankrupt because of you. Whatever you do, you cannot get out. What happens then? You used to just be fine, but now they take the money and you die. Is it because footballers play at night? No, that seems wrong. I'm not allowed to give you any help. You have to figure it out on your own. <laughs> Look at his little nose. I love it. Um, what are you doing? I'm watching that dog trend on TikTok. You are so stupid. Wait a second. I can't believe it took you so long to figure out. Taylor Swift? Yes. I knew I was smart. Penguin techniques? I don't know. What the fuck are you talking about?
Guess the artist again? No, you barely got it last time. You can't risk it. If you lose, you'll make everyone bankrupt. Sorry, did you say that I should do it? Because I agree. Purple, brunette, and vampire. <gasps> Adam Sandler. We're screwed. Why would it be Adam Sandler? I don't know. He's probably worn purple before. It's musical artists. Oh, I know. Harry Styles. I think someone dropped you as a baby. Victoria Justice. No, I don't think they just dropped you as a baby. I think they threw you at the wall. Really? Hey, what's that record? I don't know. I found it in the basement. I think it's Dad's. You're so stupid. Read it. I already did. It says Olive. Of course you can't read. Do it one more time. Olivia Rodrigo. Ugh, finally. Hey, I got a point. No, excuse me? 7-1? What, is my soulmate Bigfoot or something? Man's is like a walking skyscraper. My soulmate's only 5'4". Aw, oh, short king. No, it's not cute. Why not? All of my kids are going to be so short. <laughs> well, it's better than the ugly gene that you're going to give them. <gasps> I am not ugly. Um, who are you looking for? My soulmate. That's how you're going to find him? You know, I don't think I could miss him. He is 7'1". That is so funny considering you're like 4'11", right? Okay, first of all, I'm 5'2". Thank you. Maybe he's like an NBA player. I really hope so. Bro, are you drinking from a salsa jar? 7'1's not like that tall, right? Are you dumb? That's really tall. <laughs> What's with all the commotion? Dude, there's a guy in the hall that literally looks like Slenderman. My soulmate! Excuse me, sorry, excuse me, I need to get through. We all want to talk to him. Wait your turn. He's definitely not going to talk to you when you look like Shrek. What? Shrek? Ooh. Bro, he's literally built like the Eiffel Tower. Well, how tall do you think he actually is? It's got to be over seven feet. Can y'all stop shoving me like this is the Hunger Games? It's a dude. Wow, wow, wow. These girls are going feral for him. I'm not going to be able to get to him. Um, I think I know how we can. How? Here, get onto my shoulders. <laughs> okay. Are you sure this is safe? Nope, not at all. Okay. Hey, moving skyscraper, wait up. Hey, Bailey, how's the weather up there? Shut up. Sir, hi, how tall are you? Um, 7'3". Ugh. What, do you have something against tall guys? Oh, I'm sorry. That just means that you're not my soulmate. How tall is your soulmate? 7'1". Oh, my brother 7'1". A brother? So, where's your brother at? Um, I don't know. He didn't come with me. What do you mean you don't know? It's, like, urgent. Why do you care so much about where my brother is? Uh, hard to explain. You are so weird. I'm out. Uh, wait, please. Bro, no. You're freaking me out. Can you just leave me alone? Okay, I'm sorry. So, do you want to get down, or... Yes, I want to get off your shoulders. Whatever, he looked like a grasshopper, and his brother probably does, too. You're just mad he didn't like you. Do you think that the brother goes here, too? <laughs> Who knows, but he's 7-1. I'll see him. Yeah, but will he even see you? What do you mean? You're just, like, so much shorter than him. I've had enough of the short slander. This is so annoying. Oh, my God, there's two of them! Two of who? We need to get his attention, now. Throw something at him. Okay. Not a glass. Oh! Bro, are you kidding me? Which one of you just threw a glass at my head? Should we run? Um, I think so. Yeah, okay. You two, stop right there! So are you the one who threw the glass? <laughs> Guilty. You need to come with us to the office now. Damn, we got caught. There was like 12 witnesses. Thanks to you, he now has a concussion. He has a concussion? I just wanted to get his attention. So you throw the most dangerous thing you could find. It seemed like a better idea at the time. Wait, are you the girl who's been harassing my brother? Uh, no, it wasn't me. Who else would have purple hair? Shit. Could you just tell me why you did it? Because I needed to talk to you. To me? About what? How tall is your soulmate? Um, I am not telling you that. Just tell me. It says 5'2". Wait, don't tell me you think that we're soulmates. Surprise! No way, you are not going to be my soulmate. What's that supposed to mean? You are obviously some kind of crazy. I don't like it. That is not true. I told you why I threw the glass. Yeah, but that doesn't justify it. Uh, well... I am so done with this game you're playing, I'm leaving. No, wait! So, um, I don't think he's gonna press charges. He didn't seem very concussed. 
That's the girl who threw the glass. <gasps> really? Why are y'all whispering about me when I'm right here? Oh, <laughs> sorry. I didn't know you could hear us. Of course I can hear you. It's just embarrassing that you were so desperate for attention. Whatever. It's also embarrassing that your hair looks like that. My hair is $3,000. Me. Um, I think that our plan may have backfired a little. Yeah, just like the smallest bit. I know he's my soulmate. I just need a new plan. What? It's not like you can go after his twin. Wait. No, do not tell me that. Hey, you. What? Are you going to throw a glass at my head, too? No. You're going to use me to get my brother. No, that's not what I'm doing at all. I promise. It's clear you're just desperate for a soulmate. No, I was trying to get your attention all along. I just thought you were really cute. Wait, really? Would you want to hang out with me? Yeah, yeah, love to. Here's my number. Thanks. That was, like, suspiciously easy. No, there's got to be a catch, right? There definitely is. He just said that I was harassing him, and he agrees that fast? I don't know. Maybe it's because you're cute. I know. Oh my gosh, what if he, like, murders you or something? Okay, let's not manifest that for me. Thanks. It should be one, four. Yep, this is it. Hey, uh, welcome in. <laughs> Hi. Both of you? Listen, we just have a few things to ask you. So, why are you such a whore? Excuse me? Uh, I'm just messing with you. That's not one of the questions. Okay, not funny, but go on. You need to tell me how tall your best friend is. She's 5'6", why? Because my soulmate is 5'6", too. Don't tell me you think she's your soulmate. She might be if you're my brother's. I already said I don't want you as a soulmate. I don't want you either, skyscraper. So, can you help me here? No. What? Why not? I just don't want to. It's because she's a selfish bitch. Can he leave the room? Because he's really killing the vibes. Yeah, bro, get out of here. Listen, I'll help you get my best friend if you help me get your brother. Ah, uh, Okay, I guess I can help you. Fine. Deal. Just don't throw any more glasses at his head. I know, that was a one-time thing, I swear. Hmm, I have an idea. I need to go find my best friend. Can you convince your brother not to hate me? I will try my best. Okay, thanks. Bestie. Hey, what's up? I have some tea. Do you want to hear it? Um, yes, always. Do you know that kid who's 7'3"? How could I not? I heard he has a crush on you. Oh, I'm not interested. He's not really my type. What do you mean he's not your type? He's so tall. Yeah, but it's like a little too tall. Didn't you just call your soulmate a walking skyscraper? No, I love men that are two feet taller than me. Right. Just forget it, okay? I don't want him. Wait, please. I'll pay you. Wait, are you serious? <laughs> yeah. How much are we talking here? A thousand dollars. Oh, absolutely. I'll do whatever. Yay. Oh, I'm gonna be dirt poor. This is so dumb. He's not my soulmate anyway. Mine's 5'9". Wait, what? Ooh, this looks good. No, no, don't drink that. What? Why are you freaking out? Is it alcoholic or something? Uh, no, you'll be fine. Just go to school. Okay, weirdo. Bailey, you look so beautiful today. Aw, thank you, Stephanie. Of course, have a good day. Have you done something different to your hair? Uh, the only thing I did was brush it. It looks so amazing. Am I in someone else's body? What is happening right now? Hey, Bailey, wait. You should come sit over here at our table instead. Are you serious? Yes, why would I not be serious? Last week you called me disgusting. Oh, I was just kidding. Come sit down. Okay, I guess. So, since you're our friend now, do you want to come shopping with us at Dior after school today? Um, I'll be right back. Mom, what was in that drink you gave me? Mom, what was in that drink you gave me? Uh, nothing. You're going to be just fine, honey. Wait, but... She hung up on me. Bailey, I am so glad you came back. I just missed you. Missed you too. You have to give me your makeup routine. You look so good. What foundation do you use? I use peanut butter. Oh, would you look at that? The day's over. See you later. Bye. Mom, tell me what was in that drink right now. Fine, but you cannot share anything I'm about to tell you. I won't. What you drank this morning was a love potion. I'm sorry, a human a what? A potion. You're just kidding, right? 
No, I'm a witch, and I have been my entire life. A witch? Like the Wicked Witch of the West? No, I only use my potions for good things, I promise. Since you've consumed one of my potions, you have to become a witch now, too. What? Dude, I got tickets to a rock concert tonight. Wanna come with? I don't know. Wait, I'll come with you. <gasps> Great, but you're not wearing that. Tickets, please. Oh, honey, Disney on Ice is next door. Sure you don't want the outfit. Give it to me. You look so cool. Oh my god, hey guys. Lucky you, we have two extra backstage pass. Uh, excuse me, miss. Hmm? I think that you dropped this. Oh, uh, it has a phone number and it says, call me for a good time. Oh, no wonder your score is so high. You're no fun. Come on, let's- What? We can't hear what you're saying. I'm a- Dude, I got tickets to a rock concert tonight. Wanna come with? I don't know. Wait, I'll come with you. <gasps> Great, but you're not wearing that. Tickets, please. Oh, honey, Disney on Ice is next door. Sure you don't want the outfit. Give it to me. You look so cool. Oh my god, hey guys. Lucky you, we have two extra backstage pass. Uh, excuse me, miss. Hmm? I think that you dropped this. Oh, uh, it has a phone number and it says, call me for a good time. Oh, no wonder your score is so high. You're no fun. Come on, let's- What? We can't hear what you're saying. I'm a- Dude, I got tickets to a rock concert tonight. Wanna come with? I don't know. Wait, I'll come with you. <gasps> Great, but you're not wearing that. Tickets, please. Oh, honey, Disney on Ice is next door. Sure you don't want the outfit. Give it to me. I can be adopted by a billionaire or a baker. Hey, what does billionaire mean? It must be someone who has like a billion friends. Wow, okay. Oh my, why have they given me a clearance child? And what are you wearing? I don't know. Go put this on this instant. This seems fancy. Yes, well, it's better than the Walmart clothes you're wearing. Much better, and this is our butler, Gerald. He'll take care of whatever you want. You have to get me anything I ask for? Yes, miss, that's right. Can I have an electric guitar? Yes, I will get on that right now. Here you go, one electric guitar. Sweet, thank you. So, what do you do for a job? Uh, I run a very big business. What kind of business? This is not bonding time. You don't need to know. I will not answer any personal questions about myself. Now go sit down for dinner. The private chef has made a five-course meal. For dinner tonight, we're having escargot. Isn't that like the bottom of a plane? Oh my, no, that's cargo. Escargot is snails. Snails? I don't want to eat snails. Then you may have some caviar instead. What's caviar? Well, it's fish eggs. Do you guys have, like, chicken tenders? No, of course we do not have chicken tenders. Bro, you're seriously eating a snail right now. Good for you, Slay. We're going to need a tutor to fix your grammar immediately. What's wrong with how I talk? You sound like you have three brain cells total. Tomorrow you will be starting at a private school. Cool. At my old school, one of the teachers got arrested for money laundering. Okay, let's not repeat that again. It's a school for the rich and talented. Every person there is gifted. I am neither of those things. This will be your uniform. There's a uniform? Of course there's a uniform. It's a private school. I'm gonna look like a dork. That's great. I hope so. You look so much better. I look silly. Well, that's because you didn't button it up all the way. See, isn't that great? This is worse. Now, now, we have to get going. Class, this is our new student, Bailey. Hey, guys. Hey, isn't your father crazy, Mr. Carlson? Mm -hmm. I don't know. He seems pretty nice to me. Do you know what he does for work? He won't tell me anything about his job. Yeah, because he does super illegal things. My father gave me Wagyu when I asked for escargot. Can anyone trade? Mm, no, I can't. How about you, new girl? I have a Lunchable for lunch. Anyway, have you been down into your basement yet? The basement? Yeah, dude, everyone is always talking about what he keeps down there. No, I didn't even know that we had one. You need to go down there and tell us about all the crazy things. Like what? I'm assuming you had a great first day of school. It was fine, I guess. Have you made any worthy friends? You could say that. Can I ask you something? Of course, as long as it's not about my job. Well... No, you are not allowed to know any information about my job. I cannot tell you. Why can't I know? You're my dad. It's hard to explain, but it's none of your business, okay? You are forbidden from asking me any more questions about my job. Fine, I got it. I have to find out where that basement is. I've checked every door in here and none of them lead to a basement. Did that bookshelf just move? No way, this is a secret entrance to the basement? I mean, he's still in his room. What the hell is all this? What are you doing down here? Uh, it's forbidden. I was looking for a bathroom. 
$20 to me or my mom. I don't really need it right now, so maybe she can use it. Morning to go and buy it. What did you get? I gave my 20 to my mom, so nothing. New car, what? Well, if I give it to my mom, she'll probably just give me G-Wagon for my car. <sighs> Wait, why aren't you taking any insane if you give this one to your mom, too? Well, I'm probably still gonna live with her. No, you're gonna <laughs> regret that. Ooh, I could get a mansion on the before. I think I just got $10 million. Um, what? What do you- To give me some of that. You can have some. I can't keep it all, but I have to sell to, okay? I love her. I want some of the money. Party with me for spring break day one. I actually don't go to school anymore, but all of my friends do, and they asked if I wanted to join in on the Florida spring break, and I said yes because I have nothing better to do. But once we got here, we immediately wanted to do something, so we just looked up a bar that was near us. Turns out that we had pulled up to a local bar. While we were playing darts, we attracted a crowd, and we started talking to them, and these guys said that they would bring us on their boat today. We're about to go to brunch and start drinking immediately. It's like noon, but we're gonna get some mimosas, maybe a Bloody Mary, because I've actually never had one before, and I I wanna know if I like it or not. Can't get over my voice sounding like this. Why am I dying? <laughs> I'm really glad that we didn't pick Miami after seeing all the TikTok videos that like they were banning literally everything and you couldn't do shit there. Why can you not see anything that I just put on my face? For today, I'm gonna wear this really cute bikini from Sunny Co Clothing. This is the suit, super cute. And then I'm gonna put this cover up from Finesse on top. Okay, this is the final get ready with me fit and makeup. I'm gonna go have an amazing time on the beach and get drunk. Have an amazing day, besties. I have Fruit Loops different colors if they're all the same flavor. Choose an emotion. Whatever you pick is the only one that you can feel for the day. Does this think I'm dumb? Obviously, I'm gonna pick happy. Hey, you know that goldfish you got at the fair that you love? Yeah, I love Mr. Wiggles. Well, the dog got hungry and ate him. It's okay, he probably just wanted a tasty treat. Wow, I expected you to be upset. Also, someone hit your parked car and totaled it, so now you have to take the bus. <gasps> Yay, I love public transportation. No one has ever said that. Hey, I don't want to freak you out, but I saw your boyfriend kissing Valencia. She's so pretty. I want to kiss her, too. Whatever antidepressants you're on, I need them, too. Bailey, you failed the final, which means you need to retake this class and your entire senior year. Senior year was my favorite. I can't wait to do it again. Are you insane? Who says that? Hello? Hey, we just found out your sister has life, so you probably do, too. We're going to have to shave your entire head. I always wanted to see what I would look like bald. 